in the beginning, uh, I wanted to do something to help these kids. I called Steve Hull, who uh, the Ark of Gray County, and Steve from, from that point provided me the students to work with. He comes once a week. Um, you know, we initially started out in our conversations been about a year, six months, a year ago, I can't remember, but we were going to start with a small group, which he did, uh, uh, five or six, seven folks. And then I said, well, could you come over and, and give this experience to everybody here? And he said, well, sure. So he started coming once a week um, over to our day half program and um, providing, um, and as you saw, uh, in there it's, it's really more it's not lessons it's just a musical experience and, a, and a, a, an opportunity for them to um, express themselves and to, and to have that sensory experience of, of a musical event in their lives each week. Normally these students don't get the opportunity to play music and sing. Now they're creating music, they're playing, they're uh, experimenting, they're using a uh, you know, music actually uses a different part of your brain, and uh, I think it's opened some doors for some of these students we had. Gary Lee, um, who is um, almost totally deaf, I'm wearing hearing aids so I can relate to that, but he, he wears hearing aids but is uh, very, very uh, auditorily challenged and um, he does not talk very much because of that and he's difficult to understand and I haven't heard him say five words probably in the last year and he got up there and sang today. today and, and I was like wrong. wow Gary Lee <laughs> I have not heard that much out of him in years so you know that's the kind of benefit and that's the kind of things that see that you see that just kind of bring tears to your eyes when you're in there it really it's beautiful